What's up guys? Welcome back to Dead Rising 3. So, in this part, what we're going to do, real quick, um, we're going to go up here to this challenge. It's called Fist First. We're going to kill 40 zombies with just our bare hands because we're awesome. Uh, we're also going to pick up an RPG right here, which will be useful in this boss fight coming up against this guy. And then after we do that, we're going to make our way over here uh, to this downed helicopter and we're going to pick up an LMG which we're going to need for this challenge and I'll go over all that that's a lot but uh, this is going to span over the next couple of videos pretty much we're just going to be leveling up a lot so uh, right off the bat if you haven't been following this walkthrough the thing you're going to actually need to do this challenge I mean need I, I don't really know how you'd be able to do this with your bare hands without it is uh, level 2 uh, the tier 2 melee um, thing what this does is let me just show you real quick. Uh, when you run up to a zombie, um, if you don't have it, that won't kill them in one hit. And it, whoa, what the fuck? Ah, oh, god damn it! I'll be right back. All right. So I don't know what the hell happened there. I could have sworn I set this to single player. Oh well. It's I. Uh, in case you guys are wondering, if you don't want that, go to playstyle and you can change it. So I'm back at single player. I think I was on. I don't even know what I was on. Anyway, so, like I was saying before, I was so rudely interrupted by what's his face. Um, yeah, we need, uh, oh, shit. you need this right here. You need it. All right, enough of that. There's always a taxi if you haven't blown it up, uh, right over here, just like right across. And I'm just going to use this to get around quickly. Uh, the thing about the fist challenge that I found difficult was not the fact that you had to kill them with your fist, but the fact that... There weren't any crazy huge hordes like this nearby. Well, <laughs> it's actually nearby now, but uh, most of the times I play through, it's not. And like even you see over here, if you uh, picked up the challenge, which is right over there, this is not enough right here, and they're not nearly close enough, because even with this perk, it's still kind of a pain in the ass. So, whoa! Alright, I'm down now, Nick. Let's go help Crystal. I'm helping. Jesus. Yeah, I just had to swing it one. Oh! Oh! Don't destroy the cab. Don't destroy it, Colt. I'm gonna need this thing. Um. Look at this. Just dove on the front. Don't leave me. Anyway, um. Right here in this pickup truck is an RPG. Pick it up. Right? Yeah, there it is. Uh, pick it up. We're gonna need that. Now you want to get this cab right outside the challenge window. Woo! Shake this zombie off the side of my car. Get out of here, or just punch him. That works just as well. Excuse me. God, these zombies are rude as fuck. Anyway, take the challenge. Switch to unarmed. Get in the car. And drive on over to here. Get out of the way, car. Get the fuck out of the way. God damn it, that's annoying. And I'm just gonna put myself right into this horde. Oh, get off of me. You wanna kill a zombie with every strike. Alright, now I'm falling behind. I don't like that. Kill him. Just keep spamming Y. See, I've already got a bronze medal. And once you have the wheel kick, you can kill multiple zombies with one kick. Oh yeah, I'm just clear and shop right now. Don't bother using those uh, grabs or anything. Alright, gotta get one more. There we go, gold medal. Let's just keep it, keep it going for the fuck of it. I don't think I could clear this whole damn horde just like this. Nick's in the house, bitch. Alright, move. <laughs> Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, a cave went unlocked. Uh, now we got this broken down helicopter. Um, I'm actually going to put this car facing... Oh, get off my car. No free rides, damn it. Get out. <laughs> Alright, let me just... Uh, if I start swinging that reaper around, I'm going to blow up my car. So just run in here. Where is it? LMG. We want the LMG. Grab it real quick. And get out of there. Get out of my way. Get in the car, Nick. Thank you. Yeah, you got company. What's wrong? Oh, the car's gonna blow up. 
Alright, we're hoofing it. We're hoofing it, guys. Uh, anyway. Alright, how far am I into this video? I'm not counting all that bullshit with the multiplayer. Alright, so, we did that. Um, now, let's spend some attribute points on something we're going to need for the next challenge, which is ranged. Uh, you, I fucking mean it, you need this. Or the inventory perk. Uh, the reason I'm saying this is because we're gonna have to kill, I think it's like a hundred zombies, some, some, uh, high number of zombies with firearms. The LMG has the biggest clip, but once you add range, it increases your ammo capacity for all weapons, um, or all firearms by 50%. So that also increases the ammo cap for the rocket launchers, which is gonna be really useful, uh, during that boss fight too. So let's just get that. Boom. I got one left over. I'm gonna put it into mechanic. For, or no, 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 I'm sorry. Put it into smarts. I probably should have done that first. Um, this will increase our uh, XP. almost said PP. It'll increase our uh, XP by 50% as well. Um, I think I'm just going to take a motorcycle. Fuck it. Uh, I really wish... I really wanted to, I should say. Uh, you know what? No, fuck it. No, I really wanted to separate the two challenges the videos just so you know when people are searching for it you know if they're searching how to get a gold medal in that challenge they're gonna find the video on it and they don't have to sit through the first part if they already have that challenge but whatever Move. <laughs> get stomped all right fuck it uh, over to the safe house all right I don't know if RPGs count as firearms, but I know, um, you see here I have 5 now instead of, I believe it was only 2 or 3, something like that. And I have 60 instead of 30, and now I have 90 instead of 60. Sweet. Or, um, I have 60 instead of 40, yeah. So, um, let's get, firearms are always like the one right behind it, I should remember that, I've done this enough times. Uh, Let's do... You want to grab at least four of these. So I already have one, two, three, four. Alright. And let's swap out my RPG for that. Swap out this assault rifle for it. And swap out... Oh yeah, it increases the amount of projectiles you can shoot from the Reaper as well. But I, I don't know. Someone... Please post a comment telling me what that number means for projectiles or whatever. Because I've gotten that thing down to like one and it's still like shooting out explosive skulls at people. So not quite sure if that's broken or I'm just retarded. It's probably the second option. But anyway, um, where's my motorcycle? Here it is. Let's hop on this bitch. And we're going to make our way up to here. And yes, I know, I'm passing up a Mecha Dragon, Mecha Dragon Blueprint up ahead. Said it in the first video, I don't, er, second video, sorry. Uh, I don't like that. I don't like that one. I don't know. It doesn't compare to the Reaper, you know. Excuse me, coming through. Oh, what? Why didn't I shoulder charge? Whatever. I should have that, shouldn't I? Shoulder charge? Nope, I guess it's in the agility skill tree. Alright, anyway, you just want to climb these. We're just right here. Go through the fence and you can climb these. Right over there is a blueprint for you. Uh, there's some garbage cans and shit around the corner. I recommend you stack them next to that like shanty thing. Or drive a car in here. Well, you can't drive a car in here, can you? No. Drive like a motorcycle. Something in there. Just find something that you can stand on that'll give you like at least a foot. You know, a box or something. Uh, there's some more shoes up here for health if you need it. I don't. And let me just check right here. See, that looks like it could be 100 zombies, but I'm unsure. Um, change my mind. I want to find a vehicle first so I can move. Oh, here's a motorcycle. Alright, this will do. Okay, on second thought, that might be enough zombies. <laughs> move! Actually, no, there's more over, there's more in, like, a tighter spot. Like, it's the same amount, but there's, they're in, like, a closer range, so I really don't have to move that far. 
Where's this thing? It's like right up there, right? Yeah. Sit down. Oh, hey. Hey. Oh yeah, why am I not kicking? That kills me one shot. Silly me. I think orange juice is one of the best like non-combo foods. Heals you pretty good. And I'm not gonna be coming back here, so drink that up. Let's pick up your LMG. Oh, hit me! What the fuck? How did that not kill him? God, this is like third time climbing up this this video. All right, so now that you have a car down below, because you really need all the time you can get to finish this one. And just unload into this crowd. Why are you shooting the guy on the ground, Nick? Are you fucking kidding me? That's why auto aim kind of sucks sometimes. No, 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 no! Fucking. Urgh. As soon as I start recording, everything just goes south. <laughs> I've done this like four times today, just to make sure I could do it while I was recording. So, yeah, once you have the increased uh, ammo capacity, this is really what makes the difference here. You want to get a hundred? I think I got this one in the bag. Yep, there we go. Wait, how much is it? 120? Oh, yeah, it's 120. Come on, kill, kill, kill. Got it! Oh, there's a couple seconds spared. So, yeah, you really do need all the time you can get. And, um, you can't, like, run into zombies or get hit. And I really wish you could turn that shit off on the screen, because it's fucking annoying when I can't see what I'm doing. That's like one of the worst things you can do is fill up the entire screen with text in a fucking zombie game. Are you kidding me? <laughs> That's just poor game design. Holy shit. Yeah, shit balls is right. Uh, where's that motorcycle I leaped off of? I want to put that back over by that bulldozer so I can create like a roller hawk later on. <sighs> Let's see. Am I crazy or what? Oh, there it is. Flip. Get on the bike. Get on the bike. There we go. Now drive back. Move. Crashing into shit. Don't want to set this thing on fire. You can make a pretty badass vehicle, combo vehicle with this thing later on. Anyway. Yeah, that's how you get the two gold medals there. Let's see our attribute points. We got one more. Uh, I'm going to put it into... Hmm. I think I want to put it into agility. Mechanic is also good um, for crafting weapons on the fly, but I plan to be prepared. I'll get that later. Since I only have one attribute point now, I'll just get that. Level... We're only level 13? Really? Am I missing something? Hmm. No. I think that's it. Alright, so that's that for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a thumbs up if you do, or if you did. Uh, in the next part, we're either going to help this chick with the spray cans, or we're going to take out this boss very easily, and I'll show you how to do that. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Leave a thumbs up. Comment, let me know what you think. Leave any questions in the section below. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.